it's like a bit sour. <laughs> That's me you're sensing. I'm a bit sour about this whole thing. <laughs> Food. So we're heading to Wendy's on 130th Avenue in Calgary and I used to go to Wendy's all the time and even though I used to go there all the time I have never had a Baconator. I remember one time I actually went to the drive-thru and I was sitting in the drive-thru and my plan was to order a Baconator and I got there and my brain would not make my mouth order the Baconator. I literally sat there and couldn't do it. I'm not kidding. This actually happened to me way in far northwest Calgary in Bowness. I, I couldn't do it and I just ordered my usual classic double with cheese and a chicken sandwich and I couldn't do it. So we're gonna try it right now. I'm going to try to make my mouth order a Baconator and we are going to have it and then we are going to complement that with some special edition Pringles Baconator flavored potato chips and we'll see how it stacks up. So here we are at the drive-through. Let's see if I can do it. Hello, can I just get a Baconator, please? Just a sandwich? Just the sandwich by itself. That's all I need. Okay, 986, please. Thank you. Thank you. I did it. You see, growth as a person is important. <laughs> that may or may not be what happened here. Hey, thank you. All right, let's do this. All right, so we're back home and we're finally going to try the Wendy's Baconator and the Wendy's Baconator Pringles potato chips. We'll see how much this tastes like this. Okay. <laughs> Look at the picture of this Baconator. This is absolutely not what this is saying. Yeah, so like. this is... Are you kidding me? This is what I've been scared of for 15 years? Like, yeah. the classic double is more intimidating than this, and yeah. I've had a million of those. Let's try it. Okay. This Should is... we try the sandwich first or the chips first? The sandwich, because okay. that's the imitator. All right. That's the imitator of the Baconator. Let's attempt. Okay. You Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> really? <laughs> okay. What do you want me to say? Like, <laughs> a lot of beef. Yeah, it's a lot of meat. It is, and like, look at how much there is actually in there. There's a lot of bacon, and I think there's some mayo. Is that mayo? And some cheese? Like, it, there's not anything that's... Wow, I gotta have this every single time I want Wendy's. And this freaking thing is 960 calories. Yeah, or 920 or something, yeah. That's insane! For one sandwich? Yeah. Nothing is worth eating your whole day's calorie. Yeah, and, I, and I'd rather have the lettuce and tomato and oh, all that yeah. type of stuff as well. Definitely. So I'm sure there's a market for this. People just want like a burger with a bunch of patties and a bunch of bacon. But okay, I want another bite. And then, yeah, okay, let's have the chips and let's see how, how accurate. I'm going to take another bite and see how this tastes like that. Ready for the pop? Mm -hmm. Oh, that was a good one. These are your normal average Pringles. There's nothing really. Let me smell them. Uh, yeah, there's, there's not actually any smell to them either. It was like cardboard. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> you don't even buy gum and it's called watermelon or grape and there's no way in the world anyone's gonna get confused with actual watermelon or actual grape. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I don't know what this is. What? It, what? Huh, what? It's got a cute like orangish pink mm. dusting of Baconator dust, I guess. This is like fake bacon flavor. Man, I want to live in a world where when they say something is going to taste like a bacon sandwich, it actually tastes like a bacon sandwich. I don't know what that is. It's like a bit sour? <laughs> <laughs> That's me you're sensing. I'm a bit sour about this whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> what? I don't... I don't know. I don't know what... Well, it, it's you. a very pretty color. Like, mm -hmm. wow, that really is a beautiful color. <laughs> For nail polish. Magical Baconator Fairy Dust. 
That's what it is. No. I'll say this much. The Baconator is way better than those chips. Okay. I'm not the biggest fan of it. It's fine, but... This is too much. Being unimpressed by two things in one day is too much in one video. <laughs> good bacon. Bacon's fine. The bacon is good. Yeah. It's definitely not a sandwich I would ever get excited about. You have some more of these. I thought it was going to be like double the size. Mm -hmm. Stupid food marketing. Mm -hmm. Here's the question. Would you ever order a Baconator again? No. Even if I like the flavor of it. I'm always gonna take like a classic double with cheese. I could get a classic yeah. triple with cheese if I wanted. I'm just gonna have lettuce and tomato. And I mean, you know, and Wendy's does a great job of that. I'm a fan of Wendy's. Mm -hmm. Like I've always been a fan of Wendy's. They're one of my very favorite fast food places easily. Yeah. But, you know, and, and think about when we did the blind taste test uh, chicken sandwich video, how amazingly juicy the tomato was. No, yes. like, like the freshness of the vegetables basically won Wendy's the blind taste test we did on chicken sandwiches just because the it's like the juiciest tomato we've ever had it was amazing yeah and the overall sandwich was enough that chicken on its own was good i don't think it would have alone won number one no. but but you know overall as a sandwich it won for both of us yeah and the stuff yeah. they put on it like the flavors that amazing yeah i'm not gonna give this that up for not this. this no 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 it really is pretty though it is a beautiful orange color. or pink or whatever yeah coral mm Hmm. The chips are weird. I they're weird. This is like, a weird flavor. Uh, nothing. At least attempt to make it taste like bacon. I think whoever came up with this flavor hates people. <laughs> I think that's enough <laughs> of these chips. <laughs> like, they were, put the lid back on. If you want a bunch of meat and bacon in a sandwich, and you want to get a lot of calories at once, the Baconators may be okay. There's nothing. It doesn't taste bad. On the other hand, the Pringles chips are weird, and they taste bad, and they taste nothing like a Baconator. So, Pringles, hashtag epic fail. Is that still a thing? Hashtags, I think, never really went away. No? Okay. Great. So, Pringles, don't mind you as a company, but uh, this is a fail. This is an F-, minus. this is a Z. I don't know what you want to give this grade, but it sucks. And that could not have been worse in terms of imitating a Baconator and putting it into a chip. So... Thumbs down. See you next time. <laughs>